Early winter weather can put a real monkey wrench in construction projects. Michael Anthony checked on some big projects to see how things are going. With temperatures at or below freezing in northwest North Dakota, the snow will be here to stay. Fortunately, it looks like it's not enough to impede progress at the old Eckerd Youth Pool. Williston Parks and Recreation Director Joe Barsh says they are removing the unused pool and its infrastructure. We might need a little bit more time, but I haven't heard anything as far as tabling it through the spring. So I think they're just going to keep getting after it. Meanwhile, the Williston Water World project, which broke ground in September, will continue working throughout the winter. They have completely come up with a plan for the pool. They are going to enclose a building around where the Lazy River is. So construction is actually going to continue all winter. At Williston High School, vertical construction is underway for their CTE expansion. Assistant Principal Audrey Larson says they are still set to open next fall. They're going to start roofing in November. And then um, mid-December, it should be all enclosed and weather tight so they can start working on the inside. The McKenzie County School District also has a new CTE expansion underway in Wofford City. Superintendent Steve Holand says most of the exterior is completed and will be ready to open early next year. I'm Michael Anthony reporting for your news leader. The latest seasonal outlook from the National Weather Service says the first half of winter could be warmer and drier than average.